I am 30 weeks pregnant. That is crazy. But yeah, I'm 30 weeks pregnant. Baby's hand at 30 weeks. Baby is the size of a butternut squash and baby is 17 inches, weighing 3.1 pounds. That is a big, big baby. That is the reason why I'm so tired all the time. Um, every When I go up and down the stairs, even when I'm just walking around the house, even bending down, even folding laundry, I am just out of breath all the time. It's really starting to catch up to me. I'm out of breath now just from talking about being out of breath. Um, but yeah, so your uterus is even bigger than that, which I can't even believe. And I did notice this week that my belly went from being more in the bottom to more of an exact circle. Like, I feel like my belly just looks like you took a basketball, cut it in half, and stuck it on me. Even bigger than a basketball though, like, a really big basketball. Maybe like a huge kickball. So the baby's going to gain half of a pound a week. That is crazy and incredible. It says that the baby's lanugo, which is um, all of that fuzzy stuff that keeps them warm, is starting to fall off at this stage. So their eyes are in place, they can open them, but um, their vision is just very poor. I still have a lot of tiredness and I still have a lot of difficulty sleeping. Um, those two things have really been getting to me. My heartburn is still really, really bad. Um, I have to really be cautious about what I eat and I still wake up all through the night to take medicine for my heartburn. It's terrible. Well, your baby can now regulate their own body temperature, which is the reason that they're shedding all of that hair, um, the lanugo or whatever it's called. But that's just so amazing and I can't believe that you're only pregnant for this short amount of time. Well, it seems short when you're the one pregnant, but when people talk about nine months, you're like, wow. Nine months of your life, that's a long time, but when you're the one that's pregnant, nine months goes by so fast, and you're trying to savor every moment, and you can't because it's just flying by. But when I think about the fact that in nine months, your body forms another human being, I just think it's totally incredible, and every time I start to think about it, I start crying, and especially with everything that's been going on with Indy. I don't know if you watch my vlogs or not, but I mentioned it in the vlogs with her getting bit and um, the trips to the ER and everything. I'm just starting to get very, very emotional, and yeah, it's just been a very emotional time, but I still think that everything going on inside of me is just completely amazing. And it's amazing that you can function your everyday life with all of this craziness going on inside of you. So, something that's really cute and exciting is that the baby is now strong enough to grasp a finger. Um, that, I just thinking about that, I cannot wait to experience all this all over again in the hospital. And I can't wait for Indy to experience it as well. But, um... I can't believe that the baby, I'm only 30 weeks and the baby can grasp a finger. They're strong enough to grasp a finger. Difficulty sleeping and heartburn as well. I wanted to just give you um, my favorite sleeping position to see if it works for any of you guys if you have heartburn. I actually um, prop two pillows up and I sleep, I sleep leaning on them so I'm kind of vertical on my side. And then I actually have a big king size pillow and I put that between my legs and being propped up keeps away the heartburn and having the pillow in between my legs relieves any pelvic pain. So I highly recommend putting the pillow between your legs even if you don't have pelvic pain because it helps you avoid getting the pelvic pain later. And then if you have heartburn, totally, totally prop yourself up when you sleep because it makes an amazing difference. All of the hormones at this stage are making me have crazy vivid dreams. Um, I've been having some really wacky, wacky dreams and some of my dreams are even just going through the day and the motions. Like I'll dream about waking up and checking the time and making breakfast and I think it's real and then when I wake up, I'm like, wait, when did I go back to sleep? And I really thought that I got up and made breakfast and all of that, so that's been really funny. Um, I am starting to get swollen in a lot of places, so that side effect I don't really like. 
I'm making it really short this time because I have a really busy day and I do have a lot going on with Indy. But I also just wanted to add to that I have been um, continuing to get the nursery ready. I'm continuing to find things that I want to pack in the hospital bag. And I'm also running out and getting all the essentials for baby. Um, if anyone wants to know what I think essentials are, you can just comment down below and I could even make just a video of what I feel are essentials and important for the first week home um, based on what I used and didn't use with Indy. But if you're interested in me making a video like that, you can just comment down below and I'll make one like that too. But I just think it's exciting getting everything ready and organizing and I'm trying to make our room, which is going to have the baby's bassinet, um, look really cute and babyish. So that's really fun. But yeah, so my side, my symptoms that I'm having right now are just, I don't have leaky, any leakiness. I don't have any um, hemorrhoids or any of that kind of stuff they were talking about. I do continue to have the heartburn, I have trouble sleeping, and I have a lot of dizziness from not sleeping. But I think, I think I'm gonna maybe start taking naps and indie naps. We'll see, it depends how much I have to get done, but um, I think naps might help a little bit, especially since I'm not working. It's like I might as well take advantage of the time to take a nap or something. But yeah, so let's go take a look at my belly. Twenty nine weeks pregnant. My belly is huge, massive. Oh, look at how cute it is! It's like a full circle now. Yeah, this is my belly.